Hey everyone, today I want to show you how to remove duplicates from Google Sheets. It's a little bit different than Excel, but just as easy to do. And so what you want to do is, similar to Excel, you know, you click on the column that you want to remove the duplicates from, go to Data, and normally there would be like, a, you, you know, there's a tab that pop up and you can click on Remove Duplicate. But on Google Sheets, what you want to do is click on Data, and then go down to Data Cleanup, and then you click on remove duplicates and so what's going to happen is we're going to get a, a pop-up here there's a couple different options here i only have two columns column a and b and so i'm just going to say let's say i want to get all of my columns here i've got 200 rows of data selected currently three columns so you can go ahead and sort out which data you want my data has header rows so you won't going to want to include that otherwise it might throw things off a little bit and then something that's going to happen i have my my numbered column here i'm going to want to remove that otherwise each individual row is going to be unique so we'll go ahead and hit remove duplicates and so it's showing that there were 131 duplicates found and removed and we have 69 unique rows so we'll hit ok and so we can see now we have uh, all these different unique cities tied to the states as well and so some some of the states only have one city some have four cities but now each of these different rows are uh, indeed unique so let's say if we wanted just to do the state we, we still have a lot of duplicates in the state let's say we just want to find state what we're going to want to do again i want to select that first so this time we can just select this column uh, just to filter down on state we'll go to data again data cleanup remove duplicates and then now i'm just going to hit the data has a header row and just make sure that we are just doing column B. So we'll remove duplicates. And so it's saying now 19 duplicates were found and removed, and now we have 51 unique rows. So now we should just have one individual state for each row. That's how you do it in Google Sheets. Again, a little different than Excel, but equally easy to work through and figure out. So I uh, hope this is helpful. Please let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. And remember to subscribe to the Excel Guy. Thanks and have a great day.